It's true, so I'm recording this uh, video for Auto Lifestyle. Now you can see I'm wearing a, a summer dress. That shows that the weather is nice. And we can come out here more and do more videos and recording on how we ship very good to Nigeria. I also want to use this uh, media to say thank you to all our customers that saw our video and then patronize us. Um, last time I told you that I'm going to show you uh, the background and for you to pick up if there is some vehicle that you can spot from the previous uh, video. So I'm going to go on the spot and then I will show you the background again. To if you can, if you can pick up any video that oh I, I saw this uh, car in this spot last time you did this big view. Uh, just let us know. And also, I want to thank uh, our customer. So many people have contacted us, make a poor inquiry, ask questions, uh, uh, so many things. And then um, I'm really happy to, to answer all the questions. Anyway, I'll take you inside and I'll show you how things work. Kindly follow us on the ID below. Follow us on Instagram, Auto Lifestyle on IG, also comment, leave a message, subscribe. Uh, like I said on my last video, I'm going to show you um, how things are done here. We we can help you out to even to deliver the car to your doorstep. <laughs> it depends on how uh, you want, uh, you can see no space. Everything is piled up, jammed up. Um, I have to find my way around, walk around the cars because here we deal with space, we are always cautions about how we park i'm trying to go to the location i did the video the last time you can see i'm trying to find my way around it it's so hot right now it's about 31 degree 32 degree feeling like 40 degree and it's humid so it's humid and uh, the everything is kind of uh, stuffy you can't hardly breathe that's why i'm not with mask today the last time we are using mask because i can breathe but personally i can't I can't breathe using mask in this kind of weather because the weather itself is stuffy. Nice weather, like Nigerian weather. So I'm at this spot where I was last time I did the, the last view, which I'm going to go on top of these railings. And then I'll have to view the, get the view of uh, all the parking lot. No space, everywhere is jammed. I have to be climbing on top of some cars. So I'm going to step on this car to be able to get on top of this guy. Wow, it's crazy. I'm on top of uh, where I was the last time. This is the spot where I was last time I did some view. Um, it's really hot. Uh, the last time I did some view, it's kind of cold and I wasn't wearing this kind of clothes. You can see the parking lot. This is our parking lot. We have all the way to the road. We move cars every day. Every day cars, we move them out of this country. Not only Nigeria, any part of the world. Any part of the world. Just uh, let us know, we try and walk the location and then send it. We send it by container, we send it, send it by row row. So row row means the way it is right now, that's how it's gonna be loaded inside the container. So, but the bad thing about those row row is that you don't put anything because you don't know what's gonna happen on the road. You cannot put any luggage, anything inside your vehicle. You cannot even put a slice less pin, any small thing, don't put it. Because I don't know, you know Nigerians, when it gets to Lagos, even inside container, they can still see your thing. It's not guaranteed, but we just be praying. Um, so I won't tell you that, oh, our, everything you put inside the car is 100% uh, uh, safe. It is safe, but you can't tell. You can't tell. They can, custom will, they have the right to open it. And when they open it, they too can take something. I'm not saying the Nigerian custom will take your stuff, but I'm just telling you that there's a, there's a reason that your stuff is going to be stolen. Not everything. I'm not discouraging you. We send things, everybody get their stuff but you have to let us know the value of what you are sending so we can tell you where to hide it inside the car. I'm just trying to walk on the railing. I'm walking to the, to the end of the edge, so I don't want to fall down. So um, I want to get some view, better view of the parking lot. So yeah, as I was talking earlier, I've gotten to the edge of the, edge of the um, cliff. So as I was talking earlier, these cars, when I come next time, probably in a week's time, and do this video again, you, you see this one right here? This uh, element, or what's it called? When I come next time, it's not gonna be on this spot, it's gone. So cars are moving. It's not, uh, we're not trying to joke anybody. It's the, all these cars are not going uh, to Nigeria alone. Some of them are going to, basically all of them are going to African country. 
So it's not only Nigeria, we ship to anywhere in, in, in Africa. So um, the last time that we couldn't get the video for clearing in Nigeria because uh, Auto Lifestyle was busy with some um, traditional video coverage and I'm sure you saw that on his uh, on his uh, vlog. So, but this one, I hope this time around he'll be able to go for the clearing. I'm gonna take you inside this, to the section where we load the cars. I just want to show you the view of the lot, how big and wide uh, it is. So, uh, whatever you wanna buy, let us know. Whatever you wanna put in your vehicle, let us know. We will walk you around it and then we will surely uh, give you fair price. Till even if you want a driver from Lagos to your to your anywhere in Nigeria, we get the driver that can pick up your vehicle at the Tinka in Lagos and send it all the way down to um, to to your location in Nigeria. Anywhere you want to deliver it, we have fair price, very cheap. From Lagos to Abuja, to be precise now. From Lagos to Abuja, wow! Oh my God! From Lagos to Abuja now is uh, ten thousand naira to deliver your car from Lagos. To Ibado, fifteen thousand. So it depends on the distance. Shagam, it might be seven thousand, five thousand, even within Lagos. Mowe, we have price. Let us know, okay? Talk to us. Talk to the Auto Lifestyle. Send a message. Like, subscribe. I'm trying to get back to the cliffs and find my way down. Yeah, so um, as I said, give us a shout, send a message. It's so hot right now, like it's so hot. You can't believe two months ago it was cold. I can't even wear this this dress. Now I'm wearing this. Three months time, I'm gonna stop wearing this kind of a dress. We'll go back to our cold uh, weather lifestyle from from Canada. So I'm gonna go inside get a video for how they are loading it. It's been towed and it's been offloaded. Um, there's a tow truck, so this one is going for shipping. We don't do accident car, like I said, but if you want to buy accident car, I can help you out to get it. So we don't buy, we don't do accident car, but uh, we, we, we have uh, someone who can, uh, uh, if you want accident car, we'll check it out for you, get it for you, buddy. Personally, I don't go with the accident car uh, also. The problem is too much to handle for me. But if you don't mind, we'll look it up for you. Yeah, we have a tow truck. I can pick up the car from anywhere in Canada if you want to pay. So everything is uh, intact. Everything is available for you. Again, like I said, I'm going to show you how the container is being brought in. Now it's, they are backing it up back now. So it's coming back in now. So this is the space which is going to go into it. So this spot takes two uh, containers. Um, the other one is going to go on this one. And then that is the container coming in now. So um, this is the container coming in. Petroleum position is parking. So there is a car on the way. This car is uh, disrupting this container. So um, they're working on taking away this uh, Corolla. So the container is right there waiting, waiting for for a road to be clear. You can see no one is uh, no one is showing him how to go. boys that will be showing you, oh, Drew, bye-bye. Hey, yeah, well, yeah, well, it's only the driver. Only the driver is the one controlling it. The driver alone. It's the one uh, bringing the container in. No boys. Nobody. Nobody, nothing. Nobody. Nobody is controlling him. He's going to open the door. If I can capture that side, you can see the door is open. He has to open the door before he, can. he goes in. 
So I don't want to be on his way because it's, it's, it's not safe. Safety reason. I'm not supposed to be here while he's doing this. Because I'm safety. You can see it's raining. Well, and now I understand how stressful and crazy it is to record a video. I'm just going to show you a quick uh, um, click on how they put it on the on the container, and then uh, you guys can have uh, some uh, what is it called? Some idea, and then you will be thinking maybe they are trying to scam you or something. So you can see now this one is empty. And this one is ready to go. Even at this spot, I'm not. Uh, I'm not even allowed to stay on this spot because it's not. Uh, it's not safe. You have to have. Uh, you have to have some safety gear to be able to come to this spot. <laughs> no, no problem. No, no, no problem. You see now, you have to pay for everything. Two. Two dollar for ten minutes. So if you use thirty minutes, you know how much it is. So that's why you guys have to click on the like button. I believe that vehicle, yeah, that vehicle right there, it's a Sienna. So that's how they hang any SUV van. But car, they they put it at the bottom. So this is the new, the empty container that just came in. So the one that just packed right now. So that's the. It's empty, right? Before the end of the day, it's gonna be it's gonna be loaded in. And this one, this one now is uh, is going on parts. You can see, you can pieces it. You can pieces the car for you if you want uh, your car to be pieces so I can sell it. So these ones have have been pieces, and then this is most of the parts that has been pieces out. So uh, this is a part of the engine and then uh, the parts. All these things are going into the container. So this one, we can see another very quick thing. So like I said, anything you want to do, anything, just let us know. If you want us to, be, to, to help you to buy the vehicle and cut them up and load them up and give you the estimates and everything. And uh, yeah, we do everything. Basically, we do everything here. Anything you want to do. Boys are working, men are working, no time, it's money. Even though they know me, but they're just joking with the $2 per, per 10 minutes. It, sh it should be something per hour, but anyway. So yeah, basically that's it. Um, when I have time again, I'll come for another video. You can see someone is going with a mattress. So you have to, you can do anything. You are, you just let us know. And then we will uh, tell you what's going on. Yeah, you can see, like at uh, this this side now, stuff that is going into the container, like engine, mattress, um, stuff that is going off. Uh, anything like this fridge, fridge is contraband, meaning that you have to pay. You have to set the custom in Nigeria. But if they want to follow protocol, it's country bound. You are not expected to bring it into the country. But the container has already been set. They've already moved cars around. Part because space is very vital in this uh, country. The, the company has their own um, confirmed based um, clearing agent. He, they, they've been dealing with this agent for, 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 for years. So it's the same agent, affordable. No anky panky, no crazy, no no story, no no joking, nothing. So anytime you want to ship, if you use us, like I said, we have somebody who is going to deliver the vehicle to you at your doorstep. If you want to trust our work, because most people don't want to trust our work and then they want to use their own uh, agent. So uh, like I said, we have agents everywhere. We have uh, in Nigeria, we have over here. Just let us know and then we will help you out with your vehicle talk to us and then we can uh, help you out so yeah just talk to us contact app auto lifestyle is going to get in touch with us and we, we connect all the time we connect every time so talk to us and uh, you can see the road is clear the container is gone and then uh, the container is gone the road is clear right now so
So those two, uh, those two container are living today as well. So when this one goes, another one is going to come in to be loaded. Then that's it for the day. So in a day, we load basically six to eight container in a day. So it depends on how how busy the day is. So we load six to eight container in a day. So just uh, connect with us, like our page. Like our page, share, follow us on Instagram, Auto Lifestyle, um, and then uh, we'll walk you out.